All right. All right. So you can pick who's going first. No, you lost, so you can decide. Ah, fine. <laughs> All right, I'll go first. Let's see. Okay, this is a hand. Yep. All set. Two cards face down. I'll then normal summon Lone Fire Blossom. I'll activate its effect tribute uh, itself. Special summon a plant type monster from the deck. So I'll summon Orphur Scorpio. Mm -hmm. Orphur Scorpio's effect activates when it's summoned. I send one monster from my hand to the graveyard, Squid Rosera. To then special summon any one credit point from my deck. I'll summon Arlington Cobra. Are you serious? You're already getting out starving, Venom. A Darlington Cobra special summon by the effect of a Predator Plant monster. I search out my deck for a Polymerization or Fusion spell card. The card I'm going to get will be Ultra Polymerization. Mm hmm. So, what are you gonna do? Uh, I'm really tempted to do something, I can tell you that much. <laughs> Please don't tell me you're gonna activate Ultra Polymerization turn one, that'd be dumb. Not yet. I'll activate Fragrant Storm. By targeting Darlington Cobra in the graveyard, or not in the graveyard, on the field, I can destroy it, then draw one card. And if it's flanked by a monster, I can reveal it and then draw one more. Draw. So I drew. Card I drew was Predoplast, so it is not another plant. You don't need to reveal it when you draw it's not a plant. Alright, I'll tell you, because I'm asserting my dominance. I'll set a card face down, and then I'll end my turn. I'll draw. I normal summon Neo Space Connector. The Neo Space Connector is normal or special summon. I can special summon from my hand or deck one Neo Spatian monster or Elemental Hero Neos in face up the fence. So come on out, Elemental Hero Neos. Then next, I activate the spell card, Polonization of these Neos and Ring Kuribo. That's right, I'm fusing my two main monsters. And uh, Wing Karibo being a level 1 effect monster and Elemental Hero Neos. Come on out, Elemental Hero Brave Neos. Next, I'll activate the effect of Neo Space Connector by tripping itself. I can special summon one Neo Spatian or Elemental Hero Neos from my grave in face up the fence. So come on out, Elemental Hero Neos. Then next, I activate the spell card. Ah, Righteous Justice. I destroy spell and trap cards on the field equal to the amount of elemental heroes I control. So I'll destroy. Got any response first? One. No. Oh, okay. I'll just destroy these two then. These two? Yep. Necro Fusion and Predoplast. Ooh. <laughs> then I activate Pot of Greed to draw two cards. Well, would you look at that? I'll set one and activate the field spell, Neo Space, giving Elemental Hero Neos and any of his fusion monsters that list him as a material 500 extra attack point. And if they have to shuffle back into the uh, extra attack at the end phase, they don't have to activate that effect. Battle! Our brave Neos attack your Predator Plan, or the Scorpion. So. I'll activate my trap card, Wall of Thorns. When you target a plant type monster I control for an attack, I destroy all attack position monsters you control. And there goes Brave Neos. God damn it. I hit my turn, you'll move. <sighs> oh, this is what I call a top deck. I normal summon Red of Plant Cordyceps. Mm. Then I'll activate the spell card Ultra Polymerization. I pay 2,000 of my life points to use monsters on the field that I control as fusion material. I can force Scorpio, you can also uh, snag anything in response. Hmm. Call summon Starving Venom Fusion Dragon. Then, as soon as Starving Venom Fusion Dragon summoned, its effect activates. I gain attack points equal to your Neos. Okay. So I gain 2,000 just for the stack. Huh. Go into battle. With 5,800 attack points, I'll attack your Neos. And Neos is dead. Alright, then, uh, it is your turn. I'll draw. So how much attack is he at? He's at 28 now, right? Because he's only in- 28 now. Yeah. Alright, I'm almost in elemental hero spot for an attack point. Now, here comes a really dumb idea. Battle! I'll have Sparkman attack to Starving Venom Fusion Dragon. Sparkman's destroyed. Yep, Sparkman's destroyed. I take 1200, and then I activate my trap. When he's destroyed, 
definitely the fact of it only during my battle phase when a normal monster I control is destroyed. I destroy one monster you control, gold, which is yours, starving venom. Yep. And then I special summon that uh, normal monster from my grave. Starving venom fusion dragons effect activates and destroys all monsters you control when it's destroyed. Good special summon monsters, right? Yep, all your special monsters are destroyed. Is it? If, yeah, this fusion spawn card is destroyed, you can all uh, your special summon monsters. I got my turn, you know me. Hurrah! Let's see. Alright, during my standby phase, the effect of my Cordyceps activates. I banish it to special summon two Predaplant monsters at a level 4 or lower from my graveyard. But for the rest of the turn, I can't special summon monsters except for fusion monsters. Or can I normal summon or set? So, I'll summon, uh, Predaplant Squidrotera. And let's go with Predaplant or for Scorpio. Mm -hmm. I'll be summoning them in a pack mode. I'll set one card face down. I'll go into battle. I'll attack you directly with Orpher Scorpio. Twelve. And then Squidrocero for 18, or 800, not 18. Ooh, I'm living with 800. <laughs> it's your move. My move. I'll draw. I'll set a monster in defense. And then my turn, you'll move. Alright, I draw. Ah, this would have been great. I set a card. Or for Scorpio, will attack your face now. It was Elemental Hero, oh, Clayman. Take 800. Alright, I'll move Squidrosera into defense mode, and then I will end my turn. My move, draw. Hmm. A normal summon, Neospatian, Grand Mold in attack mode. What are you doing, gold? Don't worry about it. I'll have Grandma battle. I'll have Grandma attack your Squidrosera. Alright, and it is destroyed. It's a fact activates when it's destroyed. Uh, I place one Predator counter on each of your monsters, and they become level one, uh, as long as they were level two or higher. Alright, I end my turn. Yeah, no, just, just as long as they have a Predator counter. Alright, let me spawn my tokens to keep track, because last time that happened, it wasn't a very cool thing. Yeah. Alright. They have a counter. Well, they each have a counter, it's still your turn. Alright, I end my turn, we'll move. Alright, I draw. I'll set one card face down. I'll go into battle, or for Scorpio, we'll attack your Grand Mole. I'll activate Grand Mole's effect and the start of damage step. If it battles an opponent's monster, I can return both it and the opponent's monster back to the hand. Alright, so it's bounced to the hand. Mm -hmm. Then, I'll set monster face down and I will end my turn. I'll draw. I activate O Oversoul. I can special summon one normal elemental hero monster from my grave, so come on back, Neos. And next I normal summon Neospatian Grand Mole. Then next, I'm gonna contact fuse them by shuffling back Grandmol and Neos back into my deck. I can special summon from my extra deck. Elemental hero, Grand Neos. And because of Neos space, Grand Neos gains 500 attack, bringing him to 3000. Then, I equip him with the equip spell, Instant Neos space. It makes it so that during the end phase, if he were to shuffle himself back into the deck, he doesn't have to activate that effect. Next, I'll activate Grand Neos' effect. I target one monster you control. Is it one monster? Get one monster you control and bounce it back to the hand. Oof. Battle. I'll have Grand Neos attack you directly for 3,000. Alright, uh, yeah, I'm gonna activate Predator Planning. I can send any one Predator Plant monster from the deck to the graveyard, but then I get to place a Predator counter on each of uh, your monsters. Okay. I'll send. Yeah, it doesn't matter what you send or what I send. Uh, I'll send Drosophilium Hydra. Alright. Then it gains a counter, but literally I'm gonna die regardless, even if I use this effect. Oh, that's not... There we go. I forgot about Ultra Polymerization. I could have built up a bit of a better... A bit of a better defense. <laughs> oh my god, that was a top deck, wasn't it? 